This is our A, a herd of the ancient Celtic White Park here at Seed Savers. We have two herds. We've got our A herd and our B herd. And that way we can swap out bulls. So they keep the genetic diversity up. Now right now we've got a bull from the Bar B Ranch out in Montana. And we'll bring those in about every three years. Just to, again, increase the genetic pool or diversity. When we're looking at these animals, um, like, like a nice body on them, we don't want it necessarily too big. We're looking for the um, black ears, black hair around the nose, and then black socks on them. And a nice leer-shaped horn with um, a black tip. Now, you also have a recessive trait that's red, which is perfectly acceptable where they have the red ears, red nose, and just red markings. There is another recessive gene that is, throws the black calves off. They are generally fairly easy to work with, easy calvers, um, but they still have a little bit of that wildness left in them. We don't um, grain them at all. We feed them hay in the winter down here in the valley, but they stay out all winter long. I enjoy working with them. I wasn't brought up around cattle, but um, and a lot of people are real intimidated by the horns, and they do know how to use them and they protect themselves with them, and that, that's great in this environment where we have to worry about coyotes and other things. But um, for the most part, they're easy to work with once you learn their distinct personality traits. And there's always an honorary one out there that uh, you know you have to watch a little bit more than the rest of them.